Well, all right, all right, all right. Welcome to another one about my son's World of Tanks Xbox One subscriber highlights replay. We're uh, watching A1R Donkey, or maybe it's Air Donkey. A1R Air, it's one or the other. He's in his E75, he's on steps. And um, this is going to be a full game replay. So uh, we'll sit back and hope you enjoy. And I'll try to do my best to uh, give a little bit of uh, of uh, commentary to it and um, see where we go from there. E75, there's what, I think three three or four tier nines, three tier nines on each team. And uh, so it's not a horrible game. Um, should end up okay. Shouldn't be too tough of a tough of a challenge. Then again, that depends on the team too, because you had, could have a complete idiot team. You know, it happens more often than not. So, um, you know, if he has a couple good players that play alongside him, and uh, he can hold his own, then uh, he should have a good game. Looking at the way the teams roll out right now, I would say that uh, his team isn't the most competent in the world. We got two or three heavies sitting back near the uh, spawn. Um, four actually right now, but I think one's moving towards the east. Um, but yeah, the two posting up right now at G7 is just pathetic. It's just not where you're supposed to be. Now I know they have a lot of heavies on the team. Um, mostly heavies. So, you know, maybe a couple of them should stay there, I guess. Maybe. Uh, but there's four, five. One pulled way back. Uh, K, K7. Pull back as far as he can. Um, so you know he's an idiot. And you got another one still sitting at the flag. He's not the brightest cucumber. Um, but he's pulling up now, right? Yeah, he's pulling up to the to the hill. So he's gonna go you know, sniper mode. So. Anyways, we'll get to the game here with uh, Donkey and see what happens here. He's got an FCM 50T, and he gets tracked and tracks 50T in return, and the 50T reuses his repair kit. No chance of getting shot. But he decides to throw his repair kit away. And he doesn't even back up. He still sits there. I don't understand the, the idea of him using his repair kit there. Because he just... If you're going to use a repair kit, use it to get out of dodge. Not to uh, just still sit there and then end up taking this shot for 476. Uh, if he'd used his repair kit and taken off really quick, he would have never took, taken a hit. So I don't know what his deal was. Or just not use the repair kit. You know. But either or, got a conquer in front of him now, which is it's it's a formidable tank. You can take 497 out of him there, and you notice that Donkey here is side scraping. E75 side scraping is is one of the best tanks in the game in this situation. Um, he's doing everything right at this point, so IS2 ready to come out around, and he's going to give a little uh, nice 483 out of the IS2 for his troubles of driving forward. <laughs> So uh, he's still got three three heavy sitting on the line at GH7 area, you know, defending that base. And you still got one at K8, and two lights sitting way back there. It just an, it pretty much an idiot team. Gonna come around here and put a big one right into the ass of the FCM 50T. Um, so yeah, you're gonna notice that uh, that Donkey's gonna have to do a lot of work here because his team uh, not the brightest. They're they're pretty bad. A lot of them are. There's a few decent ones at the end, but most of them are pretty shitty. I'm going to finish off the FCM 50T, and right here, Donkey makes a little bit of a mistake. He should have turned a little bit more to the left. Um, but he makes a smart move here and gets back to where he can side scrape. Or that's what I, I felt he was doing, was backing up to get into a side scraping position. Um, but that's okay. He's going to rede redeem himself right here by taking a big chunk out of the Conqueror 495. Um, making that Conqueror think twice about pulling up. And he's going to go right after him. So we're going to try to get into a situation here again where he's side scraping. You can see he's going to come up, put a shot into him. That's a very dangerous move. He was lucky not to get hit. Um, right there. But you notice right now he's turning sideways. He's going to try to side scrape out because that's E75. Side scraping is one of the best tanks in the game. Anything going to come out for him? Yep. He finishes him off. Waits for the next one to make a mistake. And we see this guy still at the back of the map. Sonic 1NZ. He's the heavy out the back. Saying negative. Hiding at the back of the map. 
So you still got the three in the middle. Everyone that went on the right is destroyed because, you know, had no help from the, the two lights sitting in the middle of the base, you know. We're going to finish off that IS. The IS-2 uh, is back in the garage now. And now he has an IS-3 sitting up there. And this shot right here from the IS-3 amazed me that this went. I don't know how that that sunk. But uh, Donkey if, returns the favor and goes right on the attack. Um, so this next shot from the IS, which should have gone into the lower plate, of course, bounces. <laughs> And uh, Donkey sends him back to the garage. Goodbye, IS-3. And you notice Donkey doesn't go for the flag here. He's going to turn like a decent player, a good player, and head to where the Reds are. And again, we have this Sins guy requesting fire from the back of the map as far back as he can pull. Just complete dipstick, really. just. And then, of course, the heavy that was with him, you know where he's going. You know where he's going right off the bat. He's headed to the flag. Because that's, you know, what the best best ones do is head right to the flag. But yeah, that Sonic Nins, whatever guy, he's in a T-29 at the very back of the map. Hiding on that hill. It's just pathetic. Comes across a challenger out in the middle. Good place for the challenger to be. 468 out of him. He's going to sit right there and put another shot into him. Uh, starts moving forward, but then starts taking some fire and smart decides to back up, break contact. Get to where he's not being spotted. They're still throwing some shots over this way, but they don't know where he is because uh, he's not spotted anymore. So, And there's the Bulldog. Can you get a shot on the Bulldog? This will be a heck of a shot if it goes. Come on, come on, come on. Ow. Screw you, RNG. And then our favorite T29 at the back of the map over there. He's still hiding way at the back. Look at him. We'll get him way back there. And now he's gone. So yeah. T-29 kills a T-29. But uh... T-29 right there is going to take a pretty big hit of 600. I think that's the highest roll this tank will roll, isn't it? So yeah, Donkey uh, put a 600 into that guy. That was an excellent roll. I wish I could see some of them rolls. <laughs> I don't seem to get any of the 600s and stuff when I'm in this tank or the WZ-111. And both of them will do it, but I never seem to get them. And he's finished off, so there's only two tanks left. And, of course, we got a douche on the cap. Douche. Bag on the cap. Two tanks left. Plenty of time left. You know, and this dipstick's going to sit on the cap because, you know, it's just because he's pathetic. It's at uh, Chronic. He's in a clan, too. Um, of course, it obviously doesn't mean anything if you're in a clan, because clans have idiots, too. Um, you know, you notice uh, Donkey, he ain't going to have any power of that. He's going after the uh, AMX 5100. 5100 finishes off a guy, but uh, Donkey's going to put 488 right in his ass and finish him off. So there's only one tank left. And you think that heavy would get off the cap? Of course not. Because you'll see at the, the post-game results, he pretty much did nothing all game. Followed Donkey around that side. And then sat on the cap. Because that's what good douchebags do. Still sitting right there. Four on one. It just, there's no rhyme or reason for it. Of course, he's almost dead. I'll give him a little bit of leeway there. You know, he may... Then get off the cap, though. Just get off the cap. Let them, let the other te teammates finish them off. Now you know where the other guy is. Definitely get off the cap. Nope. He's not gonna. And, of course, he gets a 424. 600 on the T-29, but a 424 on a tank that, you know, one shot could have finished off. He gets an ace tanker, high caliber. Um, 6,714 damage dealt, 1,300 blocked. 3489 for XP with a multiplier, 97,000. Almost a hundred thousand silver. So yeah, definitely, definitely a good game. Five tanks destroyed. We'll take a peek there. Top of the list, of course. Nineteen hundred uh, base XP, six thousand seven hundred fourteen damage dealt, five kills, and of course that chronic Andy did a whole seven hundred sixteen damage in his one ten, a one ten, and that's all he did. And then he goes and caps. It's 
You can't make this shit up, people. 17 shots fired, 16 hits, and 16 penetrations. So, good game, Donkey. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please comment, rate, subscribe. Remember, when you're on Battlefield, shoot the red ones.